make sure you have the nvidia app installed if you do not have it link for it will be in the description once you have it installed just go to the nvidia app go to settings and make sure you have these two options enabled nvidia overlay and game filters and photo mode after that you want to go to the download for this program is called Blockshade. if you don't trust it you can go through the source it's in the github so the download is going to be at the bottom so right here releases just click on whatever it says right there then scroll down and click blockshade.zip download it wherever then extract the file that's in it delete the .zip and then run blockshade click yes and just click install if you don't know what this does it's pretty much installing shaders for your roblox so pretty much allowing you to use shaders on roblox again if you want to know exactly what it does then you could just go through the github this is optional but these are community presets that you can install that other people have made i'm not going to install any though just click next then you can uncheck these if you want that's what i'm going to do i'm going to click finish and then the shaders are installed so now you can go into a game through the website you don't have to go to roblox player you know run a certain program you could just run it off the website and before you ask yes this works for block shop as well if you're the type to play full screen on roblox then make sure you use f11 at first so if you use alt enter do not use it yet do f11 instead make sure you're in full screen and then just do alt f3 on your keyboard if that does not work then do alt z and then go to game filter then by default you should be at none and if that's the case just click any one of these numbers it could be a one two or three it does not matter i'll be clicking one and then if you scroll down you're going to see there is a bunch of shaders you can use including the default presets that Blockshade comes with so i'll be using my own if you want to use it then just join Blockshade's official discord server it will be in the description and i'll show it later in the video on where exactly to look in the discord server if you don't know so anyways make sure you're on f11 first if you play full screen and then apply the shaders and there you go this is my shaders and i'm gonna use alt enter and there you go i have shaders on roblox and it also has motion blur for people who like motion blur now for those who want to get the regular version of roblox back do not worry i'll show you how to do it in this video there are two different methods to uninstalling the shaders so one is the website's official guide on how to do so link for that will be in the description you can go through the guide and that's how you uninstall it now if you're a lazy reader i'll just show you guys how to do it in this video so just go to control panel click uninstall a program and look for roblox player you're going to want to uninstall that and then after that just reinstall roblox and you should have the regular version of roblox this is how you fully install the shaders including the shaders that block shade installs for your nvidia and all that so first things first you're going to want to right click on the roblox player shortcut and click open file location after that you want to delete roblox player beta.exe and then you're going to see euro trucks 2 do not delete that one right click on it and rename it and rename it to exactly as shown in the video roblox player beta and then you can close out of that next you're going to want to do windows plus r and you want to type in exactly as shown in the video press enter and then look for a folder named nvidia corporation and look for the Ansel folder and then just delete it. And now here's how you install my preset that I've shown in a video. So you want to go to the link in the description. It is Blockshade's official Discord server. So right here. Then just scroll down. Now at first it's going to ask you what color you want. Just pick any. Doesn't matter. And then scroll through the channels until you see the Blockshade category. And look for presets. This one right here. It is a thread in which you could find multiple different presets including ones that aren't officially in block shade. And then just click this and then search up Kiwi's RTX graphics. I haven't posted it yet in this video, but you will be able to see it by the time I've uploaded this video. But this is the file that you will get from the Discord server. It's not gonna be this exact name, but it will be named something. But after you install this .ini file, just open block shade and click settings, click import your own Ansel preset, and then select the file that you downloaded from the Discord server. And then you can just go in game and use my shaders. At this point of the video, you may click off. I'm just gonna show you guys a quick fix on problems that you guys may encounter. So if you experience issues with opening the menu or like the effects not working, then just go to set up block shade, then click settings. Do not click install, click it settings. Then just click fix block shade effects. It fixes both the menu and effects. If you encounter any issues and I haven't shown you how to fix it in this video, you can check this website or just join their Discord server and you know look for a way to fix it. 